did he provide to this offense? Uh, he brought us a spark. Uh, he brought us a spark to the stadium, uh, fans, us. Um, and he did a great job. What seemed to go wrong after you guys were able to get two touchdowns in the second half? Uh, just lack of execution. Um, you know, we just got to be better in that aspect and uh, you know, hammer home on those details. Pat, that play that he made, so third and eight down in their end, he threw it to you over the middle. He took a huge hit. Yeah. Um, what did that kind of show you just with what he can maybe do? Yeah, he's a gamer. I mean, that's why they drafted him in the first round is to make those plays, and uh, he's going to stand on his pocket and deliver him when needed. How do you get back to playing the defense you guys want to play? It's like I said, it's just winning the, 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 the weighty downs, the necessary downs. Uh, we lost way too many third downs uh, in the fourth quarter, in the third quarter. Uh, we gave up too many big plays, uh, and we're playing very unlike ourselves. <clears throat> so uh, just making those those weighty plays, those third down stops, getting off the field, getting the ball to the offense, winning the turnover battle. Nick, were you guys slower in your, in your communication when Terrell went out or any, any guys, or was it Zach Wilson making really good reads? No, nah, it was nothing to do with communication. Um, they adapted to, to our game plan. They started throwing the uh, passes outside the numbers, away from the robber, which, which, which was what I was playing. Um, and, you know, he, he gets paid too. You know, he's an NFL quarterback. He's going to make great throws. Um, but, you know, and when they adapt, we got to adapt. So you knew coming out of the, or you knew inside the locker room, or did you know when you got on the field? No, nah, I was just focusing on me. I ain't know really much nothing. I was just make sure I ran the right route, make sure, you know what I mean, do my part, because you'll, you'll, you'll try to get into that, and then you forget what you got to do. So I just kind of stayed on, you know, my business. It seemed like there was a pretty quick connection with Kenny. Had you done much with him in, in practice, live reps, or anything like that lately? Uh, I'll probably just say the certain play call and then the defense, the looks they was giving us. So it's not like a, you know, like a certain connection. You know, it's just he just took what, it, what the defense gave him. The pitch to you, what, what was that play going to be? Just, just a, a toss, toss right? with, a, with a pulling guard? And yeah, guard. toss right. Yeah. yeah. I mean, uh, I might have been a little too deep. Uh, I, you know, simply just dropped it. But, yeah. Did you even get I would have thought it was yeah, it touched feet. my fingers. I could have caught it. Uh, but before that, it looked like you guys had it locked up. Did, were you feeling it? Yeah, I mean, when we felt the momentum coming in, uh, you know, didn't come out the way we wanted to. But you know, we're going to go into this week, make those changes, the proper changes, watch the film, and you know, capitalize on everything. Looks like on the pass to Blake Davis, the ball might have hit the ground. They were running up to the, to the line of scrimmage. Is there anything as a defender you can do in that situation? Uh, I'm just worried about the next play, honestly. You know, we, can't, we just got control. We control, and we didn't do that. And towards the end of the game, we just all got to look at ourselves in the mirror. We can all be better. We got to. Did you feel like you had some rhythm built until that point about midway through the fourth? The ball started strong, um, but still, it was. The main points they put on the board, um, it's unacceptable. Uh, we just got to get back in the lab this week, starting tomorrow. Um, we just got to be better. Is there a noticeable spark from him when he came in in the second half? For you I mean, guys on offense? Yeah, like, as soon as he came in, the crowd was like happy for him to get in and whatnot. So, you know, that made us, you know, get it going. And uh, we was able to put points on the board. Did you interception? Was that, uh, was that tip before it got to your hands? Yeah, so the player uh, tipped the ball and I wasn't able to get my hands on it. So, and they made a play on the ball, so it is what it is. How can you describe how this one slipped away from you guys? You got to play better. Uh, got to uh, hold on to the ball, you know, just make those tough catches and those uh, tough moments. And, uh, you know, that's all we can do. Just continue to execute. Like we can just say what we can do, all the this and that, and the third every, each and every week, like about how we could have did this and that. But like, just, just talk too much. We just gotta play, put it, put it on display. That's all we can do. How frustrating have all these ups and downs been? Because you guys played so well for a good portion of the game. Um, definitely frustrating. I would say you want to come out on the other end of these games um, and keep moving in the right direction. Whether it's a, uh, you know. So, um, I mean, all the games are meaningful, you know, most importantly, uh, week in, week out, especially um, in the broad spectrum of the division, um, you know, just games, certain situations, scenarios, uh, like I said, we just got to find ways to come out on the other end of, and, uh, you know, all we can do is, um, you know, tip our hats off to that team and, you know, competing. Um, obviously, we competed at a high level today. Um, but just didn't get it done. So uh, just keep finding ways to keep coming together. You know, um, this is not an individual, obviously, 
uh, deal. This is not uh, just a one guy type of thing or just one play defines the game. So uh, just finding 60 minutes. You know, nothing less than 60. So uh, you know, that's that's obviously a start. On a three start, is there confidence in this locker room? You guys can bounce back from for that. sure. You know, we got 13 games left, man. It's it's a lot of ball left. You know, and that's not to say that obviously you never look over a game, you never look over the outcome of a game, but we got so much ball ahead of us. Um, you know, uh, just obviously come together at the right times. Obviously, the sooner the better. You know, um, but again, just finding ways. You know, uh, being consistent. Uh, obviously, how we approach the game, and um, just a detail in our work, making the plays that we got to make, and then obviously creating turnovers and creating the plays um, just to keep momentum of games. Um, and uh, just keep, like I said, keep us moving in the right direction.